Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to change the new Gmail appearance back to a more classic view that we are all familiar with. So, I'll show you guys a couple different ways on how to get some of the features back of the older Gmail appearance. Now, full disclaimer, this is not going to get you back the appearance exactly how it was a few months ago as Gmail is constantly changing. So this is going to just make it a little bit more familiar for you guys who might be used to using Gmail quite often. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. So first thing I would personally suggest would be to go up to the gear icon in the Gmail window here and left click on the settings button one time, which is the gear icon. And then go ahead and left click on display density underneath choose a view, left click on compact, and then left click on OK. So that's actually going to make a pretty big difference in my opinion and really gets back to how it looked before. And you can also hide the sidebar by left clicking the little arrow to hide the side panel. So for the most part it seems that you pretty much get back to where you were before. Now if you still really have an issue with how this appears you can also load Gmail in the basic HTML format. So, for example, if we were to sign out of our Gmail account here and sign back in, as the Gmail logo was loading here, you could load basic HTML in the bottom right corner. So if you just left click on that, you can see we're using a really older version of the Gmail appearance here. But if you guys want a classic Gmail view and you really don't like all the eye candy stuff, this is for you. So just wanted to give you guys a few different options here. And if you ever want to go back to the standard view, just left click on Gmail view standard and that will get you back to how it looked before. So again, I do have this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.